Hey, what's up, everybody? George here from Scott Studio. Thanks for joining me here on YouTube. Today, we are doing a tutorial on The Blood by Andre Crouch, identified in a lot of our churches as a traditional song or a hymn. So stay tuned. Scott Studio. All right, welcome back, everyone. Just a couple of quick things before we get started. Make sure you check out our website at scottstudio.me. There you're going to find information about Scott Studio as well as workshops and events that are coming up. Um, we are currently in the process of having a worship vocal workshop on July 22nd, 2024. Um, and so if you have uh, praise team people who want to uh, come and learn and improve their singing. That might be an event that you're interested in. Um, there's also information to contact us if you're interested in one-on-one -on -one lessons, group lessons, uh, workshops for your church music ministry. If you're a leader and you need music ministry consultation, whatever you may need, um, we have that available. So feel free to contact us there um, and we'll we'll we will be happy to speak with you about how we can meet your needs. Also, in the link below, if you'd like to schedule a consultation with us, there is a direct link in the description right below. We also have merch, and so if you would like to support um, Scott Studio here on YouTube, feel free to access our merch store um, right below this video, as well as... Uh, there is a tip jar there. And so if you would like to uh, do that as well to support us, uh, you're more than welcome to. Also, lastly, if you have not subscribed to this channel, do me a favor right below your screen. Hit the subscription button. Make sure that you like and share um, so that we could continue to grow here on YouTube and offer you this free content. Thank you so much. All right, so today we're going to be learning about The Blood by Andre Crouch. We're going to be doing it in the key of D, okay? All right, and D normally has two sharps, which is F sharp and C sharp, okay? And we're going to start with the chords uh, for the verse, and both verses are the exact same, all right? All right, so we're going to be starting on a D chord, so we have D, A, and D. We have F sharp, A, and D. Okay, so that's for the whole line, the blood that Jesus, and we're gonna be switching to a four chord or a G chord, G, B, D, all right, and then back to D. All right, now we're gonna go from there to our five chord to an A. All right, and I like to throw in this little passing chord a and we're going to go to what we call a G sharp or a flat diminished okay and then back to D all right so let's do just that portion with the verse it says the blood that G E thus going to 4 G shed for me back to d all right now we're switching to an a chord a c sharp e all right a flat diminished a flat b d a way back on calvary now when we get to re i like to change it to a d7 so i'll just lower that d to a c Okay, now we're going to go to a G chord again. All right, the blood that gives me strength, a flat diminished again. All right, from day. All right, now we have A in the bass, D chord, A, D, F sharp. All right, day to day. All right, 
Now I'm playing what we call a B7 chord. So we have B in the bass, A, D sharp, F sharp. Okay, or E flat, G flat. Okay. Now let me do that one more time. So um so we, so we go back to the blood. That was a four chord or a G chord. The blood that gives me strength. A flat diminish or G sharp diminish from day D over A to day. Okay? Alright. Now let's do it will never lose its power. Alright, now I like to walk up to the it will never. So I'm doing E, F sharp, E minor, B, E, G, A, A D, F sharp, F sharp, E minor again, G, B, E, G in the bass. Now the bass is going to go back to E, and we're going to play this chord. So this is what we call an E9, okay? And it's going to resolve like that. So we have G sharp, or A flat, D, F sharp. Keep that thumb there on G sharp. C sharp, E. B, D. So lose is going to resolve to a chord, a E A C sharp and then D. Okay, let me do that one more time. It will never, it will ne ever lose its power. Now I like to do kind of a G to a D. When we get to the power, it's power. Or you could do is power, like a G sus. Or a D sus, I'm sorry. G A D power. Alright. And then to give it that little traditional flair, I'll do uh So it's like a G chord, B D G. A D F sharp. G flat or F sharp in the bass, E minor, E, G B E, D. So it goes. Okay. Now I'm gonna play the whole verse through. Verse one, two, and three are all the same pattern. Okay. All right. So I'm gonna read through verse one just so you know where we are. So you got the blood, that G. Jesus shed for me. Going to A. Way back on Calvary. The blood that gives me strength from day today it will never lose its power all right now let's do the chorus and i like to do that little g sharp diminish or a flat diminish into a so bum it reaches going back to it but we're going to play e on the bass to the high yes my mountain all right let me slow that down a little bit so you got g sharp diminish it reaches and i'm going to go back to the same chord in the right hand but hit an e in the left to the back to the a chord I is mile. So I have A, D, F sharp, E minor, G, B, E, and then D, D chord, F sharp, A, D. Keeping the A, the D the same. So you have mile, mountain. All right. And I might, and I might throw in that G sus again. Dum, bum, bum. All right. Going back to that same diminish. 
it flows a chord, the same thing, to the lowest valley. So it repeats again. Now this time, when we get to here, we're going to walk up. E, E, and then hit a diminish. I'm sorry, a D7. So what we have is a G flat or F sharp in the bass, A, C, D, F sharp, or G flat. So let me do that walk up again. To the lowest valley. Okay. All right. Now the blood. The blood. Now I like to put this G7 in there. So we got G, F, B, D. Blood. That gives me strength. G sharp diminished, A flat diminished again. Then we're going to play D over A from J. So A in the bass, A, D, F sharp. To J. Okay. B, A, D sharp F. Now we're gonna do the same thing we did at the end of the verse. It it will never lose its power. Okay, now I'm gonna play through the entirety of the song so that you can get a feel and add kind of a little bit of that gospel flavor in. Okay. Walk down. All right, now we're at the chorus. Okay, so that at least gets you started. Of course, there's a whole lot more gospel flair and passing chords and runs you can put in there. Um, but for the sake of it making it accessible to everyone, I uh, just try to simplify it so that um, you can access it. All right. If you have not subscribed to this channel before you leave, make sure you hit the subscription button. Make sure to like and share. Check out our merch. Check out our website, scottstudio.me. And one thing I failed to mention earlier is we also have a additional channel entitled Now Worship that has uh, soft worship music that you could play during prayer time, altar time, just throughout your day, whatever you need it for. It is also available, so that link is also in our description. George here again from Scott Studio. Thanks for joining me here, and I will see you in the next tutorial. Take care. Start to